Hello, this is one of a series of videos that will address questions submitted to RF Safe by email. Today's question, will trees die from exposure to 5G radiation? This is a very intriguing question as RF Safe has done our own in-house experiments using crest seeds exposed to Wi-Fi radiation. More videos are popping up showing evidence of 5G hazards in the news media, such as the one I'm about to show you from the Daily Mail website, which shows very compelling evidence that street lamp mounted 5G small cells may indeed be causing trees to die. It's got a light right there. The transmitter on the top. These 5G transmitters are lethal. If that's what it's doing to a tree, right next to a tree, think about what these are doing to our health. Now, I don't know about you, but I call this clear evidence that everyday people are witnessing negative effects of 5G. The telecom industries would like you to believe that this is fake news. However, the only thing fake is the industry statements that assume this technology is safe without scientific peer-reviewed studies to prove its safety. Now, we can't condemn citizen journalism as fake news when it shows the absolute need for federal governments around the world to open their checkbooks and begin funding much needed studies that simply don't exist in these 5G frequency bands. It's irresponsible to present this technology as safe when governments have not done their job to fund studies that would confirm its safety before mass 5G deployment. RF Safe's in house experiments demonstrated Wi Fi radiation negatively affected the number of sprouts and yield dramatically. This leads us to believe that all life is potentially negatively affected by microwave radiation exposure, and studies need to be done. This is yet another way that trees are being affected by 5G. Which brings up my point of a tree for tree policy. If telecom companies are going to kill a tree, they need to plant one too. If you have any 5G questions from my mailbag or questions on any other subjects, please send them out to support at rfsafe.com. Thanks very much for watching.